For his final trip home, Secretary Norm Mineta flew into the International Airport named for him. The commercial jet that transported his urn was greeted by water cannons shot from two of the airport's newest fire rigs that also bear his name. Despite decades of government service in Washington, San Jose was always special to Mineta. Before proceeding to City Hall, a motorcade carrying his urn was accompanied by his wife and a rear admiral taking a route through Japantown where he grew up. Preschool children stood outside the San Jose Buddhist Church to share their love. A choir sang outside the Wesley United Methodist Church. The hearse drove by the home where Manetta grew up on North 5th Street. Scouts stood at attention at the railroad tracks where Manetta and his family were put on a train and taken to a Wyoming internment camp during World War II. Manetta wore his scout uniform that day. That injustice shaped his work as an 11-term congressman and then as a Secretary of Commerce and of Transportation. There are many imperfections that, that, that persist today and I think that his work that he's done with the United States government and the people of San Jose as well as the, as the community we have taken one step closer to fixing all those problems. The motorcade then proceeded to the rotunda at City Hall where close friends and political colleagues remembered him as a consensus builder. Norm in his gentle and persuasive manner with his winning smile would reach across the aisle not for his glory and prestige but to build lasting partnerships to benefit the common good. Mineta was fond of telling friends of all the offices he held, he was most proud of being mayor of San Jose. Mayor Sam Licardo said there's no doubt Mineta was San Jose's favorite son. Thousands will gather Thursday morning for a memorial service at the San Jose Civic. In San Jose, David Louie, ABC 7 News.